Hello, I'm Lisa Wachman, Senior Director for Student Success here at Marshall University. We in the Center for Student Success are here to help students in whatever way they need to be successful at Mars Hill. We understand that academics are only one piece of student success. We are here to connect them to whatever resources they need in order to find their success. I want to talk to you about a couple of different things that we do on the academic side. One thing that we do is create uh, a space for peer academic mentors. These are students that we hire to work with uh, students who need help with time management and organization, and perhaps some tutoring in a particular area. This is especially helpful for first year students as they are learning to navigate all their uh, apparent free time and to be sure that they're getting everything done because it's a, a very different way of learning and keeping up with things. So we have found that that is something that students find really helpful. So I would encourage you to ask your student about uh, reaching out to us about getting some help with those kinds of things. In addition, we offer supplemental instruction in traditionally very difficult uh, and challenging classes. Things like chemistry, certain biology courses, anatomy and physiology, many gateway courses that students must pass in order to move forward in a major, and that have a very high rate, traditionally, of Ds, Fs, or withdrawal. With that program, we hire a student who has done very well in the course with that professor, and we provide training for them they typically sit in on the class, so they are getting fresh uh, information with that particular semester and that particular group. They then facilitate uh, the learning of the other students. They are not there as tutors per se, but rather to facilitate and help students learn from each other and to learn how to learn the particular material. We also are hoping to uh, get workshops up and running. It's, that's been a little challenging with COVID, but we hope to get moving with some of those moving forward in the spring. And we're collaborating with Student Life and some other uh, offices on campus to make that happen. And finally, I want to talk to you a little bit about Lion Tracks. Lion Tracks is our early alert software, and it is designed to help us it, and the entire faculty and staff to know when a student is having an issue. So a faculty member can send in a referral when they're concerned about your student, whether it's about attendance or academic performance or something else that's getting in the way of their success, including their well-being. That comes to us here in the Center for Student Success. And we manage those and we assign those to people who already know the student. Because if I don't have a relationship with that student, that's not really going to be terribly helpful for me to reach out initially. We want to depend on the people who already have relationships. That, that would be advisors, some particular faculty, coaches, uh, perhaps somebody in the student life suite, but somebody who has uh, some connection with the student because using those relationships is what's going to help us to help your student. So one thing that you can do is make sure that your student has some go-to people who are on campus, whether it's a particular faculty, particular faculty, faculty member or uh, a staff member, uh, as long as they've got somebody to talk to. Uh, you've heard about some of our other resources, the Counseling Center, Disability Services, uh, Residence Life. So there are resources everywhere. We coordinate with the Writing Center and the Math Center, which are here in the library where we are. And finally, um, if your student needs anything at all, because we work to connect them to whatever else is going on, have them start with us. And they can reach out to us by email, and our email is studentsuccess, all one word, studentsuccess at mhu.edu. And that comes to both me and my colleague, Ryan Bell, and we will reach out to your student and set up a, a Zoom meeting or uh, sometimes an in-person meeting at a distance, and we're happy to help in any way we can. This is a time of semester where students are starting to feel homesick, so please encourage them to stick it out. Uh, shiny and new has sort of worn off, so now it's time to, to roll up their sleeves and really get into it, so please encourage them and let them know that we are here to help in any way we can. Thank you so much. Hi there, I'm Ryan Bell. 
I'm the director of first year academic success. I'm coming to you from the other side of the room of the Center for Student Success. I'm in front of a big slate of maps that we have on the wall and we ask students as they come in here to put a thumbtack in for their hometown. And so it's a great way to see where students are coming from. I also wanted to point out that our neighbors um, is the new Center for Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion. Um, so we like our neighbors here and we like our position here in the Renfro Library. I want to tell you a few things about my primary responsibilities here at Mars Hill University. As the Director of First Year Academic Success, for one, I coordinate and I teach a section of First Year Seminar 111. First Year Seminar 111, the vast majority of incoming students take, um, take this course and I describe this course as how to college and how to Mars Hill. It's a bit of introspection. It'll ask students where they've come from and explore where they are now at Mars Hill University. Uh, also importantly, the, the FYS 111 is taught by a variety of instructors from a variety of different disciplines. Um, and these instructors are not only going to help the students explore their possible future um, in intended majors and minors, but they're going to be serving as the students' first academic advisors. So that means they're going to be helping them create a plan for the courses that they're going to register for in the spring and in beyond. They create a four, uh, three or four year plan. It also takes into account their extracurriculars, co-curricular activities as well, sports, what have you. So that's an important part of what I do. Um, also, in the FYS 111 section, every student has been assigned a first year mentor. These are sophomores or above uh, students that have been here before. They've been carefully screened as an application process and they've been chosen because we think that they can connect well with students in their first year and be good advocates for these students in and outside of the classroom. So they're gonna be working with those FYS 111 instructors uh, first year mentors just have a power as a peer to peer relationship that instructors that are grading the students just do not have. And um, they've been an incredibly important integral part to uh, what we do here in the first year. And then lastly, I want to explain the first year connections assignment and program. That is a portion of every FYS 111 grade. Um, students on a weekly basis are encouraged to pick one of three things, meet individually with a faculty or staff member or first year mentor, to attend an event on the, on the Mars Hill University calendar, which are full of uh, student life events, but also academic lectures. Um, and thirdly, receive academic support in the form of visiting the math or writing center, uh, supplemental instruction, or a peer academic mentor, one of the three sources that Lisa described. So those are three of my primary duties as a director of first year academic support. It's really been a pleasure getting to know your students and I always feel extremely proud three or four years down the line when I see them walk the stage. If you have any questions for us in the Center for Student Success for Lisa or me, please email studentsuccess at mhu.edu. And then my phone number is 828-689-1381. It's been great to meet you. Thanks.